Looky, looky, looky. I got my penny glasses on, so we do have a penny list. So let's just get right into that. I can't believe it. It's been like a month since I got to wear my penny glasses. So I'm so excited. So welcome, welcome back. Let me take my crown off. Uh, my crown is so heavy. It's real heavy. But that's okay because it's got lots of jewels on it. It's not supposed to be light. But anyway, um, welcome, welcome back. Let me lower y'all down some. Uh, so I should uh, raise these lights up. Because they're so low, they get in my glasses. But anyway, I should have done that before I turned y'all on. But anyway, um, we do have a penny list for June the 6th. The day after Bubba's birthday. So the administrator of the Pennies, Pennies, Pennies group. You know, he's my son. But his birthday is June the 5th. So the day after his birthday, we do have a penny list. But before we get into that... I got some mail, and you know, I always like to do the mail with y'all, but this particular mail came addressed to Peggy. It didn't come as Miss Peggy or Cor Peggy's Corner. It didn't come as any indication that it was from a subscriber. So I have to apologize because I already opened it. But anyway, um, when I opened it, I'm going to show you what was in it. Um, this was in it. Isn't that cool? Now, this came from one of my subscribers. And uh, let me tell you about this subscriber. This subscriber is Joe Ramsey. Now, you remember, I told you that Joe Ramsey is one of the subscribers that came to Fort Worth to meet me and to visit with me. And um, she uh, took me out to eat, and I showed her around Cowtown. But anyway, she sent me this. And when she sent it to me, um, she sent a message and said that uh, she got me this because <laughs> the day I made that barbecue chicken on the grill out there, that she was concerned that I wasn't cooking it at the proper temperature. So she sent me this pro uh, thermometer thing so that I can um, keep my meat at the correct temperature. So, I appreciate that, and thank you so much, Joe. I love you for that, and I will be using this the very next time I'm grilling. And uh, she also sent me this nice card. Look, it's right from Chicago. Isn't that a pretty card? Now, I've never been to Chicago, but it's um, Navy Pier Park. Navy Pier Park in Chicago is where she sent this card from. And um, she said, no penny sales th here this morning. So she didn't have to rush out. But um, she went to the Cubs game and uh, they had a good time at the Cubs game. And uh, yeah, you know, I have that bucket that I keep all my cards and letters in that y'all send me. And I will be putting that in here, this one in there, and keep it because, um, yeah, I love I love getting cards and stuff from y'all. And don't forget, my birthday is July the 1st, so y'all make sure you send me some birthday cards so that I can um, hang them up and stuff. I love to get cards from y'all, so... Uh, if you don't know my address, just look in the description or in the About Peggy, uh, about my channel. My address is somewhere in there, because I know y'all tell me all the time I still got it in there. But anyway, thank you so much, Joe. This means so much to me to get uh, a postcard and 
uh, gift in the mail. So, man, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, anyway, um, we do have a penny list for Tuesday, uh, June the 6th. And, you know, I usually don't do markdowns and stuff. You know, I, I always just done the penny list, you know. But now everybody's starting to do markdowns and stuff. And I just never have done them. But I want to talk about one particular markdown that's coming up for this Tuesday. And uh, it's the Yellow Dot Toys. And, you know, the Yellow Dot Toys, it kind of surprised me because... Um, a few times now, the Dollar General will clearance something out, and it will go like 50% off, 70% off, and then it just goes straight to a penny, and, um, I mean, straight to 90% off, or it skips a 90% off and goes to a penny, but anyway, the Yellow Dot Toys starting Tuesday are going to be 90% off. And that means if you get a $20 toy, it's going to be $2. If you get um, a $5 toy, it's going to be $0.50. Cents. So, I mean, it's going to be a good deal. Now, I was looking on the Facebook groups this afternoon, and I saw a, a few people that went and bought them at 70% off this last week. So, they might be, a, you know, a few less, but... When I go Tuesday, I'm going to put that on my shopping list. I'm going to start looking for those Yellow Dot toys at 90% off. Um, those make real good gifts and stuff because the, the, um, the toys at the Dollar General, the Yellow Dot toys, they include a lot of games and they include um, a lot of puzzles. You know, and stuff like that. So, puzzles are, are good gifts. And um, to be able to get some games. You know, there's even a few games that aren't marked with the yellow dot. That still run with the yellow dot. Um, I'm not sure which one. But I know there is one. But I don't have a lot of visuals for the yellow dot toys. But, I mean, just look for that yellow round dot. And, um... Yeah, just look for some puzzles and some games. And a lot of the toys this time of year are on the top shelf somewhere in that store because they move a lot of toys to the top shelf in the out of season so they can use the eye level shelves for the more current season stuff. So, um, yeah. So, anyway, Tuesday morning, the Mother's Day seasonal stuff will be uh, a penny. And, you know, they've got Mother's Day coffee cups. They've got Mother's Day teddy bears. They've got Mother's Day heart pillows. They've got Mother's Day socks. Um, you know, and they've got the Mother's Day uh, pop-up cards that are in that wood, I mean, com cardboard display. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, so let me show you a couple of those. Um... These are the heart pillows that says Mother's Day on it. Now, these tags are the ones that you're looking for. Mother's Day tags. They're kind of a purplish pink, but they say Mother's Day right there in the corner. These are the ones you're looking for. That will be a penny. Now, this is a Mother's Day pillow, and this is a Mother's Day pillow. So, um, these are the pillows that you'll be looking for heart-shaped little pillows. And then you've got some uh, teddy bears that are Mother's Day. But if you look, they've got the Mother's Day tags on them. So, uh, yeah. So they've got teddy bears and they've got um, uh, heart pillows and then they've got the Mother's Day socks. The Mother's Day socks, I've seen them in two stores and they come in a little box, and uh, they're kind of the, the same pink that's on these tags. The box that the socks are in are, are this color. And uh, I saw one store, they just got it sitting on the ground on that bottom shelf right where the socks and, and uh, socks and underwear aisle. And then another store had a box sitting on the top shelf. And, um, so yeah, so just look high and low and look for those boxes that has those 
uh, Mother's Day socks in it. Now we also have, and I wish I had one here because I've been wanting to try them, but it's the limited edition of those Hostess Orange Cream Pops. Um, they're Twinkies. And they got the orange cream on the inside of the Twinkies. And they, they've been in the Hostess aisles. And I haven't gotten any Hostess in a while, but I'm hoping to get some of these. So, uh, yeah, so the penny list, you've got um, the Mother's Day seasonal stuff, which includes all the Mother's Day stuff. And then you've got the limited editions Hostess Orange Cream Twinkies. So I'm real excited. I'm hoping to get some of those uh, because those really sound good. So, uh, yeah, so uh, I'm going to make a list of those and I'm going to go out and look. So, good luck on the Mother's Day stuff that's pinning, and good luck on those Hostess Twinkies, because I sure am hoping to get some. So, that's all we got. So, uh, good luck on Tuesday, which is going to be uh, the 6th of June. These things will be a penny when your store opens. So, I love y'all. Adios from North Texas. And goodbye from Cowtown, and I'll see you in my next video. <laughs> Bye now.